This week in Tackle Box, I'm going to talk to you a little bit about what we're doing today, fishing over at Catalina Island. Now, when you start off fishing for these smaller fish, the calico bass, the perch, never know what to expect right up on the kelp, you want to go nice and light. That's why I like using an outfit like this, a Fluger Reel. You can go with 12, 14, maybe 17 pound test line at the most, but something nice and light. And then we have the Ugly Stick Custom Rod, just a perfect outfit to throw small baits, something like this, a B-52. I want to go a half ounce model, at the very most a one ounce model, but when you're fishing calicos with a strip of squid or whole squid down here, you really want to go with the B-52 half ounce model. Now you have to have a bigger rod this time of year when you're at Catalina, because white sea bass swim by, the bigger halibut around, and even yellowtail swim through. And because of that, you want to bring a rod like this. This is the Dan Hernandez Custom Rod, rated for 30 pound test line with a Torque 200 filled with 30 pound test line on it. It's a perfect outfit for the big white sea bass that live around here. You can catch 50, 60 pound white sea bass on an outfit like this. Yellowtail swim through here, this will work great for that too. Again, we're gonna go with the B52 bucktail. I'm gonna go a larger model, like a two ounce model with a bigger hook, just in case you hook a big white sea bass. You want that bigger hook there, bigger target, and you pin on a whole squid or two squid, works perfect on this lure. Well, that's the basic gear that you need. Let's get back on the water and show you more exciting action right here on Sport Fishing. Here comes my fish. We got a nice calico. Nice calico bass. Nice calico bass taking a live squid, but we got a nice fish going on the up on the bow. Let's go see what those guys are catching. Okay. Oh, God, that's depressing. <laughs> 